Hello, hello. Someone else sloughed off work, and now it's your turn. Fantastic. Claire used to broadcast from somewhere around here. That's all I've got, I'm afraid. Bloody analog technology. She must have many enemies. And if we can find her, then I'm sure that they could also find her. Let's move. Late. She was playing a dangerous game, but I hate it when the fucking shits win. I'd love to listen to you moan all day, but perhaps investigating her murder would be a better use of our time. You don't have to be such a robot, Bagley. But you're right. We can do better if we get the truth. Let's look around. A lot of footmarks here. Anything, Bagley? Several individuals. Boots rather than shoes. One with a tread unique to a certain paramilitary supplier. I think it's from their autumn collection. I suppose they're suppliers for Albion. Look at the graffiti. What the fuck is it? Claire did release several podcasts critical of Clan Kelly, which you'd think they'd be used to by now. They're a criminal gang. They shouldn't expect flowers and thank you notes. Strange for Clan Kelly to leave a signature. Something doesn't seem right to me. They stole her equipment but forgot this tablet. Bagley, this is a good chance for you to do something. Tablet unlocked. Claire seems to have logged conversations on it. Okay, you've agreed to speak on the record. You are an intelligence technician at Albion and work closely with Nigel Cass, correct, Mr...? Just you. I can't believe I'm doing this. If they were to find... Out. I know. Only have to step outside to see how Albion treats people. What do you have for us? Proof that... <laughs> Proof that Nigel Cass was complicit in the bombings. What? But that's... Here, transfer it to this secure storage drive. How solid is this information? It's a recording of him talking to some... <laughs> security, drop your weapons! Gather all our equipment and get it to the carousel. Do take that wall, then get rid of this body. She can stay here. <laughs> Gang vengeance is an horrible crime, ain't it? 
Fuck me. Cass sent a squad of his goons for Claire and that other bloke. That recording's gotta be the real deal. Bastard knew about the bombings. Albion must have Claire's equipment then, along with the audio file evidence. This is finally what we need to bury this fuck. The Albion man mentioned Carousel. This must be Carousel Plaza, Albion's propaganda library. Sounds like as good a place as any to start looking. is here somewhere. Watch out, Albion security is thicker than whoever cleaned up that crime scene. There's also a lot of them around. Okay, so this will be fun then. After threat one, I say fuck these guys. Yes, well, let's focus on finding Claire's equipment, shall we? That's just crass. the suspect.
Well, I know you're listening. Let's talk. We told you the Prime Minister would turn you down. Brits love to see private military contractors on foreign streets, but not their own. He's a fool! This whole city, this whole country's collapsing. The military's held together with duct tape. Police are running scared. Someone has to save the people, Nigel. Someone strong. <laughs> they do. But I've already worked it out. The ideal targets are the Toan Conference, Parliament, and King's College Hospital. I'll provide overseas tech teams for logistics, but you can source the bombs yourself. Non-negotiable. It cannot trace back to me. You're forgetting something. And I'll get you access to filament, as agreed. Now go away. Now Scarper, or they'll kill you for sure. that makes you want to snap his smug bollocks in a pencil case, doesn't he? And Zero Day knew just which string to pull to get what they wanted, didn't they? Filament. And Cass was willing to trade it for the keys to the city. Fuck. Don't know, fam. I think I always thought there was a chance for him to... Fuck! To be the man you thought he was. Sorry, Hamish. If that man ever existed, he's gone now. We have to get this information out there. To the people. You're right. When you lot get the chance, come to Piccadilly Circus. Been working with bags on something. And this proof is just the topping we needed. London, you've been lied to. Nigel Cass and his Albion peacekeepers intend to permanently control his city. The ideal targets are the Toan Conference, Parliament and King's College Hospital. I'll provide overseas tech teams for logistics, but you can source the bombs yourself. Non-negotiable, it cannot trace back to me. Nigel Cass collaborated with a terrorist to bomb this city. Then, he set up an orbital drone program called Themis that will target you based on your stolen data. I will not allow anyone, not even myself, to jeopardize Themis. I've given you the truth. Do as you will. Actually, fuck that. Resist. Not bad, not bad if I do say so, innit? Yo, Mr. Hamish! Ha-ha! <laughs> I see you're not hiding, huh? Yeah, well, can't lock myself away from the world forever. Got a lot to make up for, don't I? Besides, you sorry lot need all the help you can get. Check it. Fucking wankers! Yeah, there is still a lot of Albion around, right? Yeah. Uh, oh. Sent that to every news outlet I could think of. They're gonna have it on the loop for a while. And when the people tweak to what it means, Cass is done. They'll be removed, prosecuted for high treason. They'll have no choice. We've done it. Congratulations, team. So what do we do? Vacation? Ha! <laughs> Just kidding. I only want to do this. There is still the matter of Zero Day. You know, the rogue hacker group that conspired with Cass and Mary Kelly to blow up London. Jesus, Backley, all work and no play. Give the squad a second or two to bask in our victory. Safe to say it won't last long. I doubt this is the reaction you were expecting, but Nigel Cass is in the news again.
the government has convened to review its contract with Albion. Nigel Cass himself has responded to requests that he should surrender to the authorities in a heated call with the GBB. Just shut up and listen to me. I will not be removed by the government or anyone else. I will die first. And many will die with me. They're calling for blood. They'll have it. This city belongs to me. I am its shepherd and I will slaughter my flock before I relinquish it. Cass has barricaded himself in his White Tower headquarters and threatened to kill anyone that tries to stop him. He is heavily armed and considered extremely dangerous. Shit. He's gone off the deep end. He's liable to take it to the streets in his state. We have no choice. We have to get to White Tower and stop him. Nigel's got a private bunker under this place where he liked to tweak his toys. I'll bet he's barricaded himself down here. Won't be anyone but the true believers around the compound. Okay, we should get started, no? Luckily, his reinforcements are limited to whoever's faffing about nearby. The enemy is among us. Be on your guard. Allow no one to pass unchecked. Cannot let anyone stop us from protecting London. I agree that it will not be in his lifetime. I will make sure. That takes care of security. You can now access the elevator to the bunker. now taking an Albion mandated timeout. You're up. Can't imagine that's pleasant. Let's finish what they started.
Find them! Crew, perform a search! So you've come to end it, have you, DeadSec? But haven't you figured it out yet? What our mutual acquaintance Zero Day set in motion? My inevitable reign, and your downfall. This is how it will always end. The natural order of people like me, and people like you. I am the law. Come down. Let me show you. against that drone Cass is wearing. Complete the network bypass to power up the EMP stations. Cass has called in reinforcements. What a surprise. You've ruined my plans, Dead Saint. But only to the road. I'll rid the city of you once and for all. Shielding is back online. 
Power up another EMP station. Heads up. She's calling in reinforcements. They won't even thank you! All your efforts, all your sacrifice! Let's get this over with. Time to end this. I will make lunch. deciding what's good for them. There it is. Death sex fatal flaw. Your faith in people. You recruit all types, don't you, straight off the streets. Well, I used to have faith in people, too. I got a good man killed once. Nigel Cass off the list. Shame. I think he would have made a smashing zero day. We have plenty of work still to do. Cass may be gone, but Albion won't disappear that easily. Expect the powers that be to find fresh excuses to keep them on the streets. That said, I think we've earned ourselves a bit of a rest from zero day as well. Uh-huh. Uh, if you 
suspect you've been a victim of hacking by a partner Oi! You put down a mad dog, dead sec. Needed to be done. This calls for a celebration, innit? And now that I'm not being hunted by a psychopath, I think I'd like to see that safe house of yours. Link me there.